What's up guys, Elliot here from Runner Films coming at you with another video slash tutorial and in today's video I'm going to show you how to do the selective colour effect. Before I get on to the video, I just say a quick hello to all my new subscribers, about there's about five or six of them, who came actually from the Footage Crate shout out, which I got, I'll leave a link to that in the description. And yeah, up here as well, whichever corner it is, I can't, I don't know how to do that. I've also got a bit of a sore throat, so yeah. Anyway, so without further ado, let's go on to the tutorial. Okay, so once you're in hit film, the first thing you're going to want to do is make a composition and put it to the settings of your actual footage. Once you've got your footage in hit film, you're going to want to duplicate it by pressing Ctrl D or right clicking and going to duplicate. And once you have duplicated it, the bottom layer, you want to go to the black and white effect, which just is by typing in black and white you can find. All it is is basically just a hue and saturation and turning saturation down and on this they just boosted the contrast a bit. The, okay so once you've added the black and white to the bottom layer you want to go to the top layer and go to the RGB key. So you're just going to drag that onto our top layer and then you're going to drop this down. Oh, drag that out of it. I'm going to click on this colour picker and just hold that down and drag it to a colour near the flower. And then we're going to just go to the invert. So now you can see we sort of have our RGB effect. Now I'm just going to move this picker around a bit so I find kind of a happy medium to where oh it is. So invert. So now we have that. I think that looks quite good. I will notice this middle bit of the flower still isn't actually purple. Bit. See through, so it's going to turn the tolerance up on that. But now you can see it's brought in all these other yellows and different colours. So to do that, we're just going to mask it out as well. But this can be quite quick. I'm just going to do a rough mask around. So something like that. Oh, let's move these points out. And we're going to go down to the controls, transform. And path. I'm going to move on and once it moves out of the way we're going to just go to the uh, position go to the clicker and just move it with the flower and you can go frame by frame with the control and arrow keys so we're just going to go through the footage like this and this may take a little bit of time but you know it looks good in the end so I'm just going to speed it up and be back once I've done Okay, so once you are done, you'll have your finished effect, which looks a bit like this. Okay, so there we go. You have done the tutorial. Now you have your own black and white with a bit of colour mixed in, which really shakes things up a bit. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Make sure you like this video, subscribe, and comment down below what tutorials you want to see. And also make sure you go and check that footage create video out. Anyway, until next time, bye. Take off. <laughs>